We can't be together forever, so we better make the time we do have something to remember. There's gotta be another town out there like this one. That would explain how the king got that pouch in the crystal. Everything makes sense. When have we ever seen a tornado of shadowy blobs before? It's not weird! This is unprecedented! Sora, let us help you track Roxas down. <laughs> Seems like a pretty cool guy. You're new around here, right? I'm Pence. They say there's a girl who appears at the second floor window, even though no one's lived here for years. So does this mean that weird stuff's going down again? The creatures from the last time were bright white. These things must be new. Man, I can't wait to get to Sleuthin. My name's Olette. Hey, did you finish up the summer homework yet? Independent studies are the worst, huh? I made that pouch myself, and I still have it. So, there shouldn't be two of them here. Donald, Goofy, how are ya? Whatever's going on, you wouldn't be here unless you had a good reason.
man, doesn't that tick you off? Yeah, that's just wrong. The cipher's gone too far this time. I mean, it's true that stuff's been stolen around town, and we've got a score to settle with Cypher and everything. So, if he wants to think we did it, I can't really blame him. See, that's not what really bugs me. What really bugs me is that he's going around telling everybody we're the thieves. Now the whole town and their mothers are treating us like the Klepto Club. Have you ever been this ticked off before in your life? Because I haven't. Nuh-uh. Never! Now, what to do? We could find the real thieves. That would set the record straight. Hey, that sounds fun. But what about Cypher? First, we gotta clear our names. Once we find the real culprit, everyone will get off our backs. Uh... Oh no! They're gone! Our... are gone! Uh... 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 What? All are... gone? Huh? 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 You can't say... why not? But you do understand what I'm saying, right? Our... are gone! Stolen. And not just the... the word. They stole it, too. What kind of thief is that? Cypher could never have pulled that off. Yeah. All right, time for some recon. That was low, you know? Oh, yeah? Nice comeback there, Blondie. What'd you say? Uh... You can give us back the... now. Yeah, you're the only ones who would take it, you know? That was undeniable proof that we totally owned you, lamers. So what did you do? Burn it? 
<laughs> Not that we need some to prove that you're losers. Replay. <laughs> now you're talking. I guess if you get on your knees and beg, maybe I'll let it slide. <laughs> Roxas! Roxas, focus! Cypher's not feeling so hot, you know? Tournament decides. Whoa! What was that? The thief? What's this? I was his first customer after he took over the shop. So we took a picture together. It's a really nice photo. Oh. Hey, you just said photo. So, Roxas, tell us about the picture thief. Not much to say. The pictures were just lying there. Then how do we prove we weren't the ones who took them? <laughs> it's a girl. You look happy, Roxas. Do not. So, like... Anybody else notice that all the stolen pictures are of Roxas? Oh, so that's why everyone thought it was us. And Cypher didn't go around accusing us after all. Are they really all of me? Yep. See? Look. Right? Every single one. Wouldn't it be weird if the thief wanted to steal the real Roxas or something? Come on, get serious. Why would anyone want to steal a bonehead like Roxas? Oh, thanks! <laughs> thanks. Do you guys think we'll always be together like this? I sure hope so. Huh? Where did that come from? Uh, well, you know, just thinking out loud. Well, I doubt we could be together forever. But isn't that what growing up's all about? What's important isn't how often we see each other, but how often we think about each other. Right? <laughs> Get that off a of fortune cookie? That's it. No more ice cream for you. Man, today's turning out to be a drag. Maybe because of yesterday's memory, Thief. Nuh-uh. You know what it is? We don't want summer vacation to be over, that's all. So, how about this? We all go to the beach! Why do we go to the beach? Because we haven't gone once this entire vacation. Blue seas. Blue skies. Let's just get on the train and go. No? Oh, come on. Maybe you forgot, but we're broke. Maybe you forgot I'm smart. Just two days to go. You and I have to make the finals. That way, no matter who wins, the four of us split the prize. Okay, you're on. You two are gonna clean up. Go get him. It's a promise.
Nice work, everyone. Add it to what we started with. We now have... Ta-da! 5,000 money! Sweet! Let's get tickets. We can't be together forever, so we'd better make the time we do have something to remember. Huh? Gotcha! Woo! Huh? Uh-huh. <laughs> Roxas! Three minutes! Okay. Four students. Roxas, the money. Wait. No. Huh? Where are you going? Remember when I fell? I had the money before that. I bet that guy took it. Guy? He couldn't have gotten too... far? What are you talking about? There was no guy. Huh? But he... There wasn't? Really? Ah, oh, boy. There wasn't anyone... there? It's melting. Sorry. Cheer up already. That was definitely weird, though. Strange. You said it. Can you feel Sora? Hey. Morning. Olette dragged me along to go shopping. Hey, you want to come with us? Um, uh, wait. Did you just see that? He's stalling. Very well then. We'll see you later, Roxas. Okay? Y yeah. Hmm. Wait up! So, you hung out with Cypher's gang today? No, it, it's not like that. Oh yeah, how was the beach? Wasn't that today? We didn't go. It wouldn't be the same without you, right? Sorry. Hey, how about we go tomorrow? We could get those pretzels and... I promised I'd be somewhere. Oh. Oh. I'm out of here. Who are you going to root for? Both of them, silly. Ladies and gentlemen, struggle fiends of Twilight Town, it's time for summer's most sizzling clash. That's right, today is the day for the struggle and title match. Who will be the one to break through the ranks and take on our champion, Setzer? Cypher! You know? And who will leave today as our new struggle champion? Gainer! Roxas! Cypher! Yes, the crowd is fired up, so you know what comes next! Let's struggle!
Hey now, it's time to introduce today's combatants, the four bad boys who struggled their way through the preliminaries. Regular finalist and head of the Twilight Disciplinary Committee, Cypher. Completely out of nowhere, who knew he'd make it so far this year? VV. An underground favorite and local attitude problem, Hayner. It's his first trip to the finals. And struggler number four, who happens to be my absolute favorite customer, Roxas! So, who will win this sweltering summer struggle? Who will take home the grand prize? The summa cum laude of struggle, the four crystal trophy! And a chance to take on our defending champion, Setzer! It won't be long now, folks. I suggest our challengers go over the official struggle rules before we begin. Hey, sorry about yesterday. What? You still worried about that? You need to learn to let that stuff go. I get a lot on my mind. Sorry, man. Wait, what am I sorry for? Our first match of today's struggle tournament will be between Roxas and his best friend, Hayner. And the winner is... Roxas! Not even friendship will slow this kid down, and Hayner put up a great fight, too. I lost. Oh, I can't believe it. I guess I taught you well. I had a lot of fun fighting you. Yeah, well, I didn't, wise guy. Hey, let's find a way to cheer you up. Nah, that's all right. Out of the way. You in a rush to lose? Don't mess with your elders. Whoa! Just look at those sparks fly. I guess Cypher didn't expect to fight one of his own boys. When did Vivi get so tough? You're mine! I... I'm not sure what just happened. Um, but the winner is... Vivi! In a positively blistering comeback. That's not Vivi. Huh? Thrash him. Looks like Cypher's withdrawn from the struggle for third place. So I'm in third now? Oh, baby! Keep it clean, fellas. And now, the match you've been waiting for. Roxas versus Vivi! What just happened? 
Huh? How did I get here? Roxas! Ladies and gentlemen, Roxas, our new top struggler! Roxas? You two, play fair now. You're at the top of the bracket. There's only room for one up here. Well, <laughs> may the best man win. Hey, Rucksack. How about you throw the match for me? Roxas, focus! Let me win, and I'll make it worth your while. Get real! Roxas, our underdog hero, versus Setzer, our defending champion. The winner of this match will be the true champion. That's bragging rights for a whole year, folks. Whatever you think is right, you're wrong. And that was a big mistake. As promised. Thanks a ton, Roxas. <laughs> One more treasure for us to share. I've got a present too, for all of us. Whoa. left of summer vacation, so don't even mention that assignment. But we agreed we'd get it finished today. Yesterday. I fell off the station tower, didn't I? You wouldn't be here if you did. But man, that was a close one. Stop changing the subject. <sighs> okay already. You win. You do the homework. Stupid independent study. So, Anybody got any bright ideas for a topic? Maybe we could study the stuff that's happening to me. You know, the dreams and the, the guys in white. Forget it. Why? You know, things have been weird with you in the town since the photos were stolen, right? Well, tomorrow, we're all gonna search the town and find out what's been going on. Lots of people are helping out. All that for me? I'll go get some ice cream.
time has come. Our hunt for the Seven Wonders begins. Whoa! Find new rumors already? Nothing on Market Street. You twerps aren't gonna scoop us. We're going to the terrace with you. Hainer, it's not a race. Well, it is now. <laughs> Come on, we can all go. these the steps you talked about? The ones that count different going up and down? Mmm... Actually, it's the stupidest thing ever, but... What? Rai's the one who counted. He's like, every time I count, it's different, you know? <laughs> so, he just counted wrong? You know, that last wonder wasn't exactly wonderful. I understand. Say no more. But this next one's gonna be really great. Wonder number six. We got another lead. The ghost train mystery. Everybody knows about wonder number six. Yeah, well I didn't. Did you find out where the train runs? You can see it from Sunset Hill. If the rumors are true, it'll be here any minute. For they say the train is empty. No driver, no conductor, no passengers, no return. We've got to make it to the beach next year. Yeah, we better get jobs the second vacation starts. Good afternoon, slackers. What are you doing out here? What do you care? I don't. Tell me anyway. We're waiting for the ghost train. Waiting for the ghost train. <laughs> Why does looking at you always tick me off? I don't know. Maybe it's destiny. Destiny? In that case, let's be friends. I don't feel like cooperating with destiny. When have you ever cooperated with anything? I know. Tomorrow. Look! It's really true. And there's really no one aboard. What's the catch? There's gotta be a catch, right? Then it's real? 
Let's go to the station. Let's go in. What? Um, you'll get hurt. Huh? The train will be arriving shortly. Come on. A train came from the beach. There was no driver, right? Let's go. Right? Let's go home and work on the paper. The rumors were bogus. The end. We can still make it sound good if we write about all the work we did. But what about the last one? The Seventh Wonder? Who cares? I do. Come on, Pence. Whatever. Roxas. <sighs> it's at that haunted mansion. You know something? Whoa. We were gonna check the mansion out tomorrow. It is the most suspicious place. Right. Even Cypher's gang was gonna help. Cypher? Yeah, Hainer asked him to. So, what are we looking for? Well, they say there's a girl who appears at the second floor window even though no one's lived here for years. Roxas! Roxas! Huh? Did you see her? Yeah. Watch the window. Closely. Ah, lame. That's just the curtains moving. There must be a draft somewhere. I'm surprised this old place even has curtains. Yeah. Well, let's head back to the usual spot. Hainer and Olette are waiting. Hey guys, how'd it go? The girl in the window? turned out to be a curtain flapping in the wind. I figured as much. The report's already done. All right. So, want to go find Hainer? He's probably at the station. You know, we only have two more days together. Huh? Summer vacation, remember? Oh. Right. Tomorrow, we search the town. Next day's the fair. The last day of summer. Don't say that. You give me an ulcer. Not if you explode from all that ice cream first. <laughs> 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 Man, I could not sleep last night. Guys? Huh?
What do you want? Uh, nothing. Just wondering what was back here. Now you know. This is our spot. Um... What? You're new around here, right? I'm Pence. Hayner, nice to meet you. But we got stuff to do, so catch you later. My name's Olette. Hey, did you finish up the summer homework yet? Independent studies are the worst, huh? Homework? Hey, what are your names? Oh, sorry. Uh, we're Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Hey there. Sora, Donald, Goofy, we just met someone who was looking for you. He sure seemed in a hurry. He had a black coat on, so I couldn't see his face. But he had these big round ears. Where'd you see him? At the station. The station, thanks. Well, you'd better get back to that assignment. Later. Wait up! Huh? Hey, Sora? What? Nothing, but... We came to see you off. It just seemed like something we ought to do. Oh. Really? Thanks. You should hurry and get your tickets. Right. They're the same. Yeah. Three tickets, please. I can't help feeling like we won't see this town again. Why not? You're thinking too much. Yeah, you're right. Okay, let's go. Bye. Hey, Sora? You sure we haven't met before? Positive. Why do you ask? I don't know. Huh? You okay? It, yeah. Don't know where it came from. <laughs> Pull it together. Right. See ya. You okay? <gasps> uh. What? You and that dog came flying out of a hole in the wall. He nearly gave us heart attacks. Oh, Sora! Um, Pence, right? Do you know a girl named Kyrie? K Kyrie? I sure do! Uh, then you better come to the station. Hey, so how do you guys know Kyrie?
Kairi was really here? Yeah. And she said she was looking for you. Tell me where she is! Well... What a romantic story. If you stick around, Sora's bound to show up. Yeah, he said he's coming back. Okay. What took you so long, Kairi? Somehow, I just knew you'd be here. I tell you, Kairi, you've got a lot of guts jumping right into the darkness like that. You think it might have been Axel? Sorry. Hey, it's not your fault. Come on, cheer up. Like I can even say that. I gotta Get help Kyrie. That was close. Are you okay? Huh? What? What just happened? A new road is open, and Kairi and Riku are waiting somewhere along it. You'd better hurry then. You coming back? Promise. Hey, are you all right? What happened? We came here looking for Kairi. Then those white things attacked us. You gotta be careful. Yeah, you guys didn't have to go and do that. Of course we did. Kairi's our friend too, you know. You're right. You know, I never thought of it like that before. Word is, this mansion gets a lot of really strange visitors. We thought this place might be the gateway to some kind of alternate Twilight Town. What do you mean, alternate Twilight Town? Hey, Goofy, do you think we could see that crystal of yours? I made that pouch myself, and I still have it. So, there shouldn't be two of them here. And this is the trophy Cypher gave you. You left it behind, remember? It's the only one of its kind. Same for the crystals. Red, blue... Yellow, green, only one of each color. But you've got your own. So, where'd you get it? Um... The pouch is from the king. 
when he gave us money for the train ride, he gave us the crystal too. But then, where did the king get it? See? There's got to be another town out there like this one. That would explain how the king got that pouch and the crystal. Everything makes sense. It does? That other town must be where whatever's missing from here went. Like Kyrie. I get it. Watch out! I got something to tell you. I found out where Ansem is. Ansem the Wise. The real Ansem. He snuck into Organization 13 Stronghold. And we've figured out where Kyrie is. I'm pretty sure we're right. But why'd you all come here? Someone gave us a clue. Who? Well, Your Majesty, Sora thinks it might have been Riku. It's just a feeling I had. Well, if that's what you think, then it's probably right. You mean Riku's okay? If that's what you think. I've waited long enough, Your Majesty. Tell me what you know. It's not for me to say. But Your Majesty, why? I don't want to break my promise. You made a promise to Riku? So he's okay. I can see him again. Huh? Who's Riku? My best friend. That's it. Your Majesty, you got the pouch with the crystal from Riku, didn't you? And you promised not to tell, right? Gosh, guys. That's enough! Yeah, let's go. Kyrie, Riku, we're on our way. We found it! How does it work? I can handle it. Okay. Here we go. Oh, what's wrong? I can't go any further without a password. Do you have any idea what the password might be? Mm. Well, we only got this photo. Yeah, the one Donald ate up. It was in the box right next to the photo. Hey, that's it. Ansem the Wise loved ice cream. Okay, what's the name of the flavor? It worked! Let's go. We'll be here to hold down the fort. Say hi to Kyrie. You bet. What was that voice? I know I heard it. I didn't hear it. You sure it wasn't the wind? Or something else? I'm pretty sure. Where'd they come what? from? Get the ice cream later. <laughs> what? Hold up. See? Voices. New ones? <laughs> 
What? Hainer? Pence! Olette! <laughs> what? what is that? <laughs> Hey, Sora! Hello, goodbye! Uh, oh. Go! We got this! <sighs> nice fighting. Thanks, Sora. Hainer, Pence, Olette! It's been ages! What? It hasn't been that long. Yes, hey. Donald, Goofy, how are ya? We're good. Howdy there, Olette. So does this mean that weird stuff's going down again? You kidding, uh. Pence? When have we ever seen a tornado of shadowy blobs before? It's not weird. This is underprecedented. Hmm, I guess it is. The creatures from the last time were bright white. These things must be new. Man, I can't wait to get to sleuthing. We are already done with the school project, silly. Whatever's going on, you wouldn't be here unless you had a good reason. Which is? Well, actually, we're looking for Roxas. Roxas? That's funny. I don't know any Roxas. Mm. But the name sounds familiar. Maybe we bumped into him somewhere. That's one way to put it. Actually, he might have been friends with another version of you. Hmm? This photograph. Yeah, we've got the same one. Oh yeah, the other Twilight Town. It's like one of those spot the differences puzzles, except really easy. I guess in that town, we're friends with this Roxas person. Sora, let us help you track Roxas down. <laughs> really? Sure, he seems like a pretty cool guy. <laughs> yeah, he is. Great, then let's all go ask around town. If alternate us knew Roxas, then maybe alternate other folks did too. Mm -hmm. Sora, you three should go to the place in the photo. It's the old mansion. The three of us will cover places in town. Thanks. Oh yeah, I got this phone thingy that takes pictures. <laughs> Wanna snap a photo while we're all here? Sure, that's a great idea. <laughs> <laughs> hmm? Wait, who's taking it? Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, why do I have to do it? Hey, tough luck. You drew the short straw. It's okay. Oh, I'm sitting out of the photo with you, Donald. Can you take the photograph? <laughs> Everybody smile! <laughs> wow! That came out great! Oh, a lucky emblem! Lucky emblem? Oh yeah, they are huge right now. Supposedly, these things are hidden all over town. And if you get a picture of them, they'll bring you good luck. Cool! <laughs> Wait, look guys, is that... <laughs> You're right! I see it too! <laughs> I knew it! Good luck, because they're not all this easy to find. Okay, we better start asking around. You start by checking out the old mansion. We'll catch up. Got it. <sighs> hey there. <gasps> 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 Thanks for the heart attack. Oh, what? 
Did I scare you? Uh, oh. Our bad. So how did it go? Did you get any leads? <laughs> nope. Afraid not. The asking around thing was a total bust. Yep. This old mansion is our last hope. You guys ready? Another Twilight Town awaits. Yeah. Here we go! Eh, the password was, uh, sea salt ice cream, right? Okay, I'm in. Let's get that transporter working. Uh, uh. Oh man, the transporter's been protected. Protected from what? I guess from us? We can't use it to get to the other Twilight Town. Why not? It worked before. We sent Sora there. Well, that was then. And this is now. And there's no other way? None that I know. Great. Oh. Huh? Hello, Sora. You wouldn't happen to be in front of a computer. Huh? Well, yeah. But how do you know that? I was tinkering with Ansem's computer. You know, to decrypt the code that was left in it. And I noticed that someone had logged in from another terminal. I figured it might be you. Uh, oh, yeah, the log terminal. You don't know any slug. Oh, and what, you do? <laughs> I know I haven't got a clue. <laughs> then, uh... Who was it that logged in? Oh, hi there. This is Pence. I'm the one who logged into the computer. Good. As long as it's a user that we know we can trust. Yup. But I'm kind of stuck here. Hmm. One of the programs is protected, so... I can't uh, run it. Which program? Uh, the transporter to the other Twilight Town! Uh, it's the only way to find Roxas. You gotta help us. Another Twilight Town? And a transporter? Okay. A virtual town inside the computer made of data. A datascape? Fellas! Mm-hmm. We've seen one. That's what we used once to investigate Jiminy's journal. Maybe I can do something. Pence, let's get a network set up. My address here is... Okay, sharing is enabled. <gasps> huh? Were you able to fix it? Now that our two computers have been successfully networked together, I can take control of the terminal there and change the privileges. And Roxas? Yes. For the virtual world to be completely realized, Ansem the Wise would have included Roxas's full data in the construction. Meaning, somewhere on your machine there's a log of that data that... Uh, basically, we can decipher Ansem's code more quickly, and we can analyze the virtual Twilight Town while we're at it. Okay, great. I can't computer, so do that. Glad you're following along. Don't worry, we'll handle it. Chip and Dale will be helping me out here on this end. I'll call you back as soon as we know anything more. Thanks. Oh, before I forget, a bit of troubling news. It's about one of the organization's former members. You knew him as Vexen. But to us, he was Ansem's apprentice, Evan. He was recompleted like the rest of us. But hadn't regained consciousness yet. Then, sometime after Lee left, Evan vanished. 
Alias and Dylan, the two you knew as Lexius and Zaldin, they went out looking for him, but he's just gone. And I'm starting to worry. Oh? You think he's on their side? I think it's a real possibility. He's a devious researcher. You should be careful. All right. Thanks. Oh no! We got work! I totally forgot! Really? But what about all this? Hey, both are important. We're gonna need some cash to go to the beach. Also, don't forget the pretzels. Gotta buy four now. Hmm? Uh... Oh, I get it. He's thinking ahead. <laughs> Later, Sora. Yeah, see ya, Hainer. Bye, Donald. Goofy. Goodbye! Oh, and since I'm manning the computer here, you guys are in charge of earning my share. No pretzel for pets. <laughs> hey! <sighs> hey! Guys! Oh. Hainer! Olette! Uh, hey, boss. Uh, Done with the posters. Uh -huh. Hey! Good work, kids. You guys work for Uncle Scrooge here at the Bistro? Um, do we? He gave us a short job putting up these special posters. Mr. McDuck's hosting an open-air film festival in the courtyard. Cool, huh? <laughs> oh, Sora. Hold your phone up to the poster. Okay. There, you've just downloaded a promo game for the film. You can try it later. You downloaded Uncle Scrooge? Of course, laddie. Provide a bit of entertainment and then give folks a nice, cozy place to relax. Like my bistro here. They'll all be happy and hungry and eager to spend their money. <laughs> Uncle Scrooge. Gore, she sure is canny. I always wondered how he keeps customers coming into his businesses over and over. Oh yeah, I'm no business guy, but I sure wouldn't want to be one of Uncle Scrooge's competitors. Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. I need to warn you guys. Why? Well, those creepy crawly things might come back for more. So stay on your toes. Sure, but don't we have you guys to take care of them for us? You have to leave again? Mm-hmm. Time. But we'll definitely be back. When are you gonna slow down? Sorry, just do me a favor. Well, what is it? Don't make it too tough. I know how Roxas feels to be lost, but Donald and Goofy, Kyrie, brought me back by wishing with all their hearts. Mm. So, I was hoping the three of you would do the same and wish for Roxas. What? That's it? <laughs> That's no favor. We'll all wish. I'm wishing. Yeah. Me and Pence, too. <laughs> Thanks. It's about time. Uh, hey, uh, shut uh, it. Uh, oh, come on. Uh, What now? Please, I have created enough victims. Yes, you have. 
All of the children sacrificed in the name of your research. So make things right. I told you I did not take her. Her disappearance was why I put a stop to the research. And that makes you honorable? You used Roxas and Namine and threw them away. I doubt there's a merciful bone in your body. You took the girl and hid her. Now show me the data you are hiding here. Roxas and Namine. If there is any reason that I still draw breath, it is to atone for what I did to them. <gasps> he said Roxas. Yeah. That man needs us. Right. Yeah. If you do find the girl, what is it that you expect will happen? The child's memory holds a mystery to unravel. One concerning the battle we seek between light and darkness. You know something, and that is why you stopped the experiments. You are completely deluded, Xehanort. We shall soon see. <laughs> yoo <-hoo! laughs> Uh... Excuse me! Who are you? Oh, well, I'm looking for a friend who used to live here. No one lives mm. here. Be gone! Um, but, sir... No, 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 not one more step! Get out! Uh, this <laughs> way! Oh. Uh. Hey, loser! Wiggly uh. things? They... protected me. Uh. Hayner, get a move on! Oh, okay. I serve the organization. This is treason. I see what is happening. Have it your way, then. Are you guys okay? Yeah. I think. <sighs> Nobody knows the twists and turns of Twilight Town better than us. You are Roxas's friends. That's right. So you know him too? Oh yes, quite well. Pay dirt. Guess it was worth staking out the old mansion after all, because this guy here is what I call a lead. That's the only proof we have that Roxas was our friend. Tell us about him. We want to know him better. My dear master, <coughs> you are safe. Who's there? Evan, is that you? So, those nobodies were your doing. been waiting for this. Gave up a normal life in order to plant myself in the organization. And when I heard Xehanort had gone looking for you, I realized 
It was my chance to find you as well. For you see, I too wish to atone. Mm. 